this was crude and poorly done. So it's probably, I don't know, I'd assume more was a false flag. Yeah, first I heard there were two drones and that they were brought down by Russian uh, like countermeasures. And so that was the drone actually coming down as a result of the Russian interference so that but, are, but but I don't know if that was true or not either. I mean, that's it's all what the fog Kremlin of war. said. They released a statement saying it was two unmanned mm -hmm. aerial uh, two drones apparatuses, and they also said, you know, we have uh, May 9th, which is our victory day. We we celebrate the end the, or when Germany fell to the Soviet Union, and so this is lining up on sort of to be an attack on our our, our national pride. Basically, this uh, is this is basically the White House. It's like the Russian version of the White mm -hmm. House. Washington Post says it's the working residence of Vladimir Putin. But to, to fly a drone, I mean, the explosion was very small compared to the building. Just to aim a thing into the top of the Kremlin, I don't see how that would get Putin. Maybe they knew where they were headed and they were trying to go right into his office. I mean, well, they kind said of, what Putin kind of drone wasn't was even it? there. 